The countdown is running and the world's most important plastics trade fair in Düsseldorf is approaching rapidly. We took on the task of visiting the most innovative companies in plant and machine engineering and today we are in Trostorf, guests of the Reifenhäuser company. Reifenhäuser GmbH and Coca G was founded in the year 1911 and today has its headquarters in Trostorf. The company is structured globally with production sites in Germany, Italy and the USA. Subsidiaries in China, Russia, India, Singapore, Latin America and Vietnam as well as 60 representatives around the world. The company is led by the three brothers Bernd, Ulrich and Klaus Reifenhäuser. 1500 employees generate an annual turnover across the whole group of around 500 million euro with the manufacture of extruders and extrusion plants which Reifenhäuser delivers to plastics processors, manufacturers of blown films, cast films and sheets, non-woven fabrics, monofilaments, PET strapping tapes and artificial grass. The Reifenhäuser booth at the K-Trade Fair will be located in Hall 17. During my visit, Bernd Reifenhäuser took plenty of time not only to explain to me the company's strategic orientation. He left no doubt in my mind as to how important Industry 4.0 is and will continue to be for the success of companies in the plastics industry. Industry 4.0 is an industrial policy term which has been used in the media for about two years now. A lot is written about it, not much of it clear. This isn't because the specialized journalists don't research their way into the topic but because with Industry 4.0, the digitalization of processes varies greatly in individual industries. Reifenhäuser recognized over four years ago that digitalization is a mega trend. Does this already have influence on the competition? Can you already create competitive advantage for yourselves and your clients through Industry 4.0? Whether you're talking about an evolution or a revolution in this digitalization and the effect it has on our industry is irrelevant. It will have a significant influence not only on our industry but on the industries of our customers and their customers too. I'd very much like to see it in detail and how you implement Industry 4.0 here. Can we look around with our cameras? We can, but not at everything. But you will be convinced that Industry 4.0 and digitalization form a strong part of our strategy. I look forward to it. Industry 4.0 mustn't be an end in itself. Rather, it has to be the basis for development of intelligent production and intelligent machines. Here, Reifenhäuser developed the digital business platform, which offers not only partial aspects of Industry 4.0 and applications, but a long-term roadmap into a digital future. And what does that mean in detail? That Herr Pampas will show you. He's a member of the digital core team and responsible for customer benefits. That's very important. That's very important. We'll meet again after your tour. I look forward to it. Thank you. Hello, Herr Pampus. Hello. I've heard that I can learn from you details of the topic of Industry 4.0. That's right, Industry 4.0 is an important topic for us. We're pursuing a platform-based concept related to the various fields within Industry 4.0. Quality diagnostics or diagnostics themselves, condition monitoring, but also predictive maintenance and other things we want to make available to our customers. The K-Trade Fair will be an initial launching point, an important milestone where we'd like to present the new operation center. That sounds very complex, with very complicated terms, combined with such a complicated plant, of course. I ask myself, will the machine operators of the future, people at all, still be able to operate it, or has everything already become too complicated? People are and always were the focus of our developments. As technology becomes more complicated, the operation must get simpler. Sources for mistakes must be reduced. The operator must be led through the machine in order to increase the speed of product changes. 
You are holding a tablet in your hand. Is that connected to this? Correct. This is Rosa, the Reifenhäuser operational smart assistant. Using this, the operator can go through the plant, he has production data, he can take photos of replacement parts, send them directly to the spare parts department, or contact Reifenhäuser quality service directly. Thank you for introducing Rosa to me. And I'll come and visit your booth in Düsseldorf to learn more details there. Happy to hear it. Thanks. All the best. Bye. Ah, oh, hello, Herr Marshall. Did I promise you too much? Absolutely not. I'm really thrilled. I've experienced Reifenhäuser all day as a company which clearly lives Industry 4.0. I'm curious, though, how visitors to K-Trade Fair in autumn will experience that. What will your booth look like? The Trade Fair booth is very open. We'll also be able to show all the innovations in our extrusion technology virtually, and especially our 4.0 approach, the Reifenhäuser Digital Business Platform. How does one get these huge machines you manufacture into the trade fair halls in Düsseldorf? How are you going to do that? We'll do it the other way around and bring the people here, to the world's largest technology center in the extrusion industry. We'll be running 11 plants there with difficult products where we can really prove our performance. So you will shuttle people from Düsseldorf to Torstoff and back? That's right. Mornings and afternoons for three days during the trade fair. Very exciting. I will be sure to hop on a shuttle and visit you here in Torstoff during the K. I look forward to Thank it. you very much. Thank you. We'll meet again in autumn. That's right. Goodbye. That was my day in Trostorf at Reifenhäuser, a company which really impressed me, combining traditional mechanical engineering with cutting-edge solutions for Industry 4.0. In any case, yet another reason to go to Düsseldorf to the K. If you like, we'll meet again for another episode of Countdown.